When I was nine, I sat in front of a portal that gave me a glimpse of a place where passions danced with possibilities. I was mesmerized by Kismet, the first social robot born of the MIT Media Lab. Kismet smiled at me as if by magic, and I knew then I wanted to uncover its mysteries. Eventually, I learned it was STEM, not magic, that made Kismet possible. The magicians were scientists and engineers. They used the language of mathematics to converse with the universe and create technology to enhance our humanity. STEM matters to me because it fuels my mission to show compassion through computation by using technology in service of others. As an undergraduate, I studied computer science and gained the magical knowledge. I developed skills to build the technology I imagined. Working with a nonprofit, I built an electronic data gathering system to help combat neglected tropical diseases. In Zambia, as a Fulbright Fellow, and in the UK as a Rhodes Scholar, I partnered with grassroots organizations to equip youth to create rights apps. I even started a hair care technology company with three other women. We use scientific analysis of hair strands to generate personalized product recommendations. From hair to rights, STEM empowers me to touch topics that impact my life. Most of all, STEM enables me to dream, to stargaze. Stargazing enables all of us to look beyond immediate barriers and see ourselves at heights previously unimagined. When I was nine, I wanted to go to the MIT Media Lab. This was not the assumed destination for a black girl growing up in Oxford, Mississippi. Now, here I am, striving to earn a PhD while leading the Algorithmic Justice League to fight bias in machine learning. I am her, daughter of art and science, fighter for justice, another hidden figure.